Hey guys, today I'm going to be reacting to episode 4 of Chaos Child, and the title of this week's episode is called Gigalomaniacs. I don't know what that means. I don't know if that's a term for something, or is it just something that they make it up for the, uh, for the anime. Um, maybe it's something to do with maniacs or something like that? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. We'll probably find out in the episode, so I don't know why I blabber on and, you know, just doing my prediction and all this stuff. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna stop wasting guys' time, and let's just dive in with this week's episode. <clears throat> What's this? Looks like a window. What was that? What was that? Yo, shit's gonna get serious. Oh my god, I'm still confused. I'm really confused. Um, you guys told me that Chaos Head doesn't have to do a lot to do with this, but it's it's really interesting and I should do a live reaction series to it, but you don't have to watch it before this. So I will do a live reaction of that after like this whole entire series is done. But like I'm confused. I'm really am like what the fuck is this anime about? Is it about aliens? Is it supernatural? Is it about gods? Is it something humans? Scientists experiments? What the fuck is it? I honestly don't know. And that's what I like about it. I like not knowing. I really do. It's not that I'm stressed out that I don't know or anything like that. I really am enjoying it. Not knowing what the fuck's going on. It's a really... It's it's like... It's almost like erased all over again like i loved for race because you don't know who the fuck was the killer and anything like that so you're like who the fuck is it you're making your predictions and all that stuff so i really like it i really like these series like these series is uh are very underappreciated like not they're not well known but they definitely should be uh, a lot like a lot more people should actually like give these animes more of a chance. Like there's another anime that I reacted. Oh, well, I didn't react to. I watched that was very similar to this. <clears> that <throat> not a lot of people watched. It's about witches or something like that. But they weren't really witches. They were, it was like scientist experiments. Excuse me. Sorry about that, guys. That's kind of sketchy. That reminds me of what happened last time. When they were investigating the apartment. It was locked first. And then it opened up somehow. Yo, I'm trying my best not to get attached to these characters, honestly. Excuse me. Is she going to get captured? Emergency. It's the emergency exit, most likely? Why the fuck is like the dead end? Oh shit. Zombies? Are those zombies? The autopsy room. It's an autopsy room. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, yeah, they ran into here in the rush. It's gonna be a body. Wait, did the bodies from the autopsy room woke up?
They have to hide there. There's nowhere else, though. So the red lights represent if it's empty or not. I don't want to be alone in one of these. Yo, I honestly would ha would be so claustrophobic. My god, especially stuck with someone else. Like, I would be freaking the fuck out. I'm not really claustrophobic. It's just, it just makes me so uncomfortable. I think everyone's, like, slightly claustrophobic. Oh, they actually looked in the autopsy things. Also, they're actually intelligent enough to actually look. Oh, that's kind of scary. No. They got him. What the fuck are they going to do? Was it all a dream? What the fuck, man? That was so fucked up. They're not zombies. Okay. They're actually normal humans. What the fuck, man? Yo, that's kind of fucked up. I can't believe the anime did that to us. But why the fuck was he, like, picturing all that? Don't tell me he's dead. I was about to say, don't tell me he just pops out there dead. Did he picture the same thing? Oh, there was a body in there. Oh, he was freezing. It was freezing in there. Oh, that's... Oh, God. You had to put the the little key on the little light thing. Yeah. Yo, they've been getting a little too lucky. It is, man. Just book it. You haven't learned your lesson already after what happened these past episodes. Like, you gotta be shitting me, my boy. We come this far. Nah, man. Yes, that's what I'm fucking saying. You haven't learned after everything that's happened. He's trying to find out about what happened to his parents, so it's understandable. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> he went through this once? It's almost he had like a it's almost like he had a deja vu for a quick second. What's going on with his mind? Oh shit, so that was in the beginning of the episode it was a flashback. So, so now it now I understand why before he was seeing zombies. 
It's because when he came here the first time, that's what he was seeing. Yo, you have to snap out of it, my boy. She's here too. What the fuck is she doing here? She's probably doing the same thing that these kids were doing. Excuse me. Yeah, it's kind of creepy. It's it's really sketchy how we got into this very easily. And then this one girl, she said she's been trying weeks to get the keys, and she finally got it. And then these kids just do it in one night. Yo, I can't believe they're the same age, though. That's really hard to believe. She looks like she's, like, in her, like, 20, like late 20s. So why is he experiencing like these visions? It's almost like he's been here before and but why is he seeing these things like these zombies and stuff? Is it like just stuff that's playing in his mind? They're probably prisoners. Like, that's not much of a big deal. The fuck is this? It's the one girl that was looking for her baby. without good reasoning. That was a little scary. There has to be something behind too, what she's saying. Honestly, that, she, she kind of put me on edge. That was a little scary. I, I don't do scary. I honestly don't. I feel like there's something behind the, the, the singing she's doing. 17th birthday... No, because I, I remember, wasn't it like some occasion earlier on this, ep um, like this series where there was a lady looking for a child or no, 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 no. That was something else. That was something else. Never mind. Huh. 
Yeah, those are the one test where they they ask you, what do you see? They were doing experiments. I see, I see. So... Who? Delusion. Psychic powers. It's going back to the, the what we were talking about earlier about psychic powers. And how each instance um, of each, um, each occurrence is like they were like hinted that they had psychic powers. So there's something tying this. Interesting. This place was shut down 60 years ago, which was the time of the incident. Yeah. The earthquakes. The sumo sticker. Does he have psychic powers? So they might have conducted experiments on him. It's the one friend. It's the one dude. It's the one girl that he's been having flashbacks on her. So she's been having those flashbacks as well. I don't like you. Excuse me. She went missing after the earthquake. Huh. So, the whole place got quiet after the earthquake. And she escaped. There's the well, an eye, dude.
There's 20 people. Or ordinarily, without going insane. Oh, she was the one girl that we saw earlier. Okay. Forgot about her for a quick second. So these are the people that experienced the experiments. And she's been taking care of them. She also went through the experiments, but she didn't go insane. Why not? Yo, what the fuck? She just goes in and makes her pass out? What the fuck? Do you don't want to end up like these guys keep up? We're starting to get some answers though, so that's good. Who's this old lady? Gigo, there it is, Gigo Mini ex Experiments. So it's the name of the experiments. That's kidnapping. She's crying. Giga low maniacs. Okay, so we got some amount of uh, answers in this episode. I'm pretty sure there's no preview in Chaos Chowd. Yeah, I'm pretty sure now that I think about it. So I guess we could end the episode here. Unless, let me make sure. I just want to make sure. I think so, maybe. Maybe there there is actually a preview. Anyways, <laughs> as I wait until the ending actually ends... Um, what was I going to say? I was going to say something. We actually got a few answers. Let's see. Is there a preview? Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't remember there being a preview. Yeah, there isn't a preview. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. I just wanted to make sure. Um, we actually got some amount of answers. It looks like, okay, going back to what happened during Chaos Ed, or what I presume. I guess happened during Chaos Head. It looks like they were doing some experiments. Um, and these experiments were called Gigalomaniac, the Gigalomaniac experiments. And it looks like when they, when they, when people went through these uh, experiments, they lost their uh, mind and they went crazy. They went insane. Except for this one girl who actually did not go insane. Um, and it looks like these experiments were to gain psychic abilities like i guess it was to awaken their mind i guess in a sense because you know how they say like we don't use enough percentage of our mind but if we were able to we will be able to use telekinesis and all that stuff so um it looks like that was the reasoning for these experiments but who caused these experiments why did they do it like i want to find more background and why did they, they, they why did they disappear at the same time as the earthquake is there some relationship to the incident that happened during well assumed the earthquake um like were they the cause of it were they behind of this or was it was it like a separate matter was it an accident that happened what happened or could it be this one girl that escaped that seems to be like their friend uh the main character's friends um could she be the cause of it because she escaped that same night and then she like with her psychic powers could she be the one that caused the earthquake um i don't know there's so many questions now um, at least we're getting some answers and we're able to, like, depict, like, 
what might be a little bit more now that since we're 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 finding out clues not really answers but we're finding out clues and those clues are kind of leading us up to like kind of understanding what's going on which i really do enjoy this anime it really makes you think um i'm gonna rewatch the f past few episodes maybe i can see like, maybe i'll notice a few things that i didn't notice the first time now that we're starting to get these clues uh now we found out also about the sumo sticker and how it was used that but it kind of triggered him after he saw it like in that form I feel like maybe he was experimented on as well, but I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Um, excuse me, guys. Uh, I would like to hear your thoughts in the comment section down below. What do you guys think is actually happening? For those of you who don't know, like, for those of you who didn't play through the games, I'd like to know, what are you guys, what are your guys' predictions? Let me know in the comment section down below, and I guess I'm going to end the video with that. If you guys like my reaction, please hit a like. Also, subscribe. Check my channel in the description box below. Also, follow me on social media. Keep us up in case anything happens. And I shall see you guys next week with the next episode. Hopefully, we get some more clues and we get some answers. Bye, guys.